Hi, I'm Jeff from Baby & Co in Bristol, and I'm super excited that we've taken a trip out from our showroom to Cybex HQ in the UK to look at some fantastic new products. We've got the Cloud Z2, the Base Z2, and kindly Tash, who's head of marketing from Cybex, gonna be on hand to give us all the new details of this fantastic new product. So here we have Tash from Cybex. She's gonna go through the, the fantastic new Base Z2. So the Base Z2 recently launched. It's been updated from its predecessor. So we have a brand new handle, which is the easier to rotate. We also have the ISOFIX indicators. They will be red if not connected properly and green if they are. We need all green to travel safely. So do you wanna just show how we attach the ISOFIX base into into kind of our, our vehicle we've got here. The load leg goes into the car footwell. If the load leg is not installed correctly, it will beep. Once it is installed correctly, it will stop beeping. Our Isofix base can be attached simply with the Isofix points. These small click buttons that will go from red to green to also show that that's installed. So now we're gonna look at maybe attaching our car seat onto the base. I'm going to pop this on because it's facing towards me. It'll be slightly easier. So we've got two metal rails under the base of the seat. We're going to locate this to this panel at the back. Once it sits in place, just a small press down, locks in place. You hear a nice audible click. And now we've got our second green indicator. So at the moment, we're obviously not in a driving position. This is for ease of loading in the car. Once we turn this to a driving position, so if Tash, you want to just rotate that round yeah. to its right position. Then we get our third green indicator. So now as a customer, you'll know that you're good to go. You've got your ISOFIX connected, you've got your foot prop down, there's no beeping, and you've got your three green traffic lights at the front here. You're good to go. There's one other safety feature on the Cloud Z, which is our side impact system. So yep. Tash, you wanna just go through that with us? So it's called the linear side impact system. And when you get in the car, you pop this out and it actually fills the space in between the car door and the car seat. And what does that mean? That means if in the event of a side impact, you were hit uh, by another car, the forces are transported through the side impact protection around the seat to reduce by approximately 25%. They've updated this base as well. So this is the new base Z2, which goes with the Cloud Z2. One of the new features we, we like, it's uh, slightly easier for the consumer to use, is the rotating mechanism. So Tash, I'll just show what you guys have done to make this easier. So you see how simple it was then for me to turn backwards and forwards the seats. I can simply pull the grey lever and rotate towards me if I was at the door. What you will notice with the seat is it will not go forward. So a baby at this age should always be traveling rearward facing. So the seat knows that the Cloud Z2 is connected to it and that it shouldn't be going forward. The big change now on the Cloud Z2 over the previous generation is... Now it can actually semi-recline in the car. And what does that mean for us? The great thing is baby can be comfortable at all times. So for sleeping babies in those slightly longer journeys, we can recline that seat to give a bit more of a flat angle. That means baby will be much more comfortable when sleeping in the car. In terms of the length of time a customer can use this seat, what, what are we looking at in terms of lengths and weights? The Cloud Z2 can be used from birth up to 87 centimetres. It's actually one of the longest seats on the market. That actually equates to around 24 months in age or a maximum of 13 kilograms. For babies that are maybe premature or born quite small, we have a newborn insert, which can be used up to 60 centimeters. So what that newborn insert does is allows for baby to have a much more comfort padding and ergonomic position when they are that little bit smaller. This is kind of your one solution from birth all the way through to toddler. So once the child maxes out this seat in sort of 18, 24 months, then you can move across to the Serona Z2, but you can still retain the same base Z2. This is also great, you know, particularly as you start to travel a little bit more with your toddler, you can 
for lots of our customers, they have several bases in their car. So if you have two cars, you have two bases, and then your toddler seat can interchange between the two vehicles. So it makes it very easy. You're not having to lift a whole bulky seat. The release mechanism is just on the front here. And also it's worth noting, if you see on the, the seat, anything with a light gray button is an action button. So it does something. So there's a good visual cue that, you know, this is, this is a mechanism I need to use. When we're going to release this off the base, put your fingers into this section, lift up, and then the whole seat comes off. You're lifting square. You're not having to lift and twist. So if you have got back issues or space is a bit of an issue where you're opening your door, this makes life a lot easier. So on to the next stage seat, the Serona Z2. This is for most parents, the next stage seat after they finish with their Cloud Z, which is gonna take them through till four. And Tasha will go into a bit more detail about that. However, you can use this from birth with their newborn insert. For most parents, when they move into this seat, it's likely that the child will still be rearward facing and they should be staying rearward facing until they're 15 months and 76 centimetres, which is the R12903 legislation. And, you know, in store as well, we kind of promote actively rear facing for as long as you possibly can. Although the regulation says mandatory rear facing to 15 months, really we want to be encouraging parents to rear face for as long as you possibly can. And, you know, for most parents, they'll keep this rear facing for the whole life of the product and not forward face it. But you do have that option later on if you wish. Mentioned earlier about the Cloud Z2 having linear side protection, the Serona Z has the same. So again, you pop that out at the side of the door to reduce that force of impact, along with the absorbing shell in which the Serona is made from. In terms of what's new, you have a new rotation mechanism, as we mentioned earlier. So again, it's easier to get a baby in and out of the car. And you have multiple reclining positions in rearward and in forward. And the great news is it, whichever position your baby is in, you can actually rotate the seat until the door. Um, so you don't have to move them into an upright position or anything like that. So again, that's one of the big changes over the previous generation that you know, customers maybe didn't want to have to incline the seat to spin it and disturb the baby, but now the baby can be nice and comfortable and you can spin it around for easy access. Of course. One of the great things with the Serona Z2 that parents won't know they need until they need it is the magnetic belt holders. There's little magnetics in the seat here which just hold the belts back. And the thing is, is you wouldn't realise how much the straps get caught behind a child. So if when you get out of the car, you just put the magnetic belts onto the magnetics, it makes life much easier when you're coming back in. You'll see these handy guides which show when you can go forward facing and when to stay rearward facing. Once you move the headrest up, you can now go forward facing because the headrest is above the guide and the headrest will keep going up to make that great space for the seat. In the reclined positions, you can either have the seat much more upright or you can take it into a much more recline for better sleeping. In terms of kind of safety, we haven't really kind of touched on that in much detail. How, how are things improved between the old generation and the new one? Yeah, so both seats actually went through the ADAC testing in October. So very, very recently. And the ADAC test tests safety, ergonomics, pollutants, and actually both seats, considering they are now three years on in terms of their predecessors, actually scored a better safety rating an important part of the newborn package that you buy is that travel system option. So with Cloud Z and all the Cybex products, so obviously the car seats are going to be perfectly compatible with the prams. So with the preamp we've got here, adapters come with it, car seat clips on, super easy. And then we come on to its, its game-changing functionality. We mentioned earlier that inside the car, the new function of the Cloud Z2 has a now a semi reclining position for added comfort. When outside of the car, we actually have a full lie flat position. That means that when you're outside of the car, baby can be in a completely ergonomic lie flat position. So if they're falling asleep or you're out for that little bit longer, 
It means that they are comfortable, but also there's no impact on their lungs in terms of breathing. And it's a great way that if you're in and out of the shops or you've popped for coffee and you pop to visit someone else, you can just take the car seat because you legally have to and just pop it onto the frame. So it's a real great way to, to have flexibility with your travel system. The hood on the Cloud Z2 is an extra large hood, but all the material is UPF 50. So again, protection from the sun, but also in the car is protecting from those sun rays. And it's always good to have it up in the car. If he was ever up in an, um, an accident, is that just added protection of any glass or anything like that as well? Most customers who are buying Cloud Z are having the base Z2 as well, but you can still use this with an app and diagonal seat belt. So we've taken the lap belt across the front of the seat, plug it into the buckle, diagonal around the back. Because this is a new regulation seat, we've got our green guides instead of blue. You'll have some handy diagrams on the side of the seat that you can follow as well as a little reminder. And obviously instructions have got all the details, but as with anything we sell, we'll give you some product training if you need some fine detail about this. But yeah, very, very simple. And, you, and you'll get kind of a really good secure fit with this. Just make sure belts removing all the slack, no twists in, in the belt, then you'll get a nice clean installation. So there we have the roundup of the brand new Cloud Z2 and Serona Z2. Both of these new models are in store and we'd love to demonstrate them for you. As part of our process, we'll obviously check compatibility in your vehicle to make sure it's, it's suitable. And then we also offer product training on how to fit your seat in the car. So when you leave, you'll know how to use it perfectly. Come into store in our showroom in Bristol and we'd love to go through these in more detail. Thank you.